What is the most exciting topic at Pay Expo this year? I think Pay Expo has a very interesting agenda this year. There is no one particular topic. If you came to a conference till last year, it was all about open banking while people were getting into the details of PISP and AISP and all of that, but the applications were not that clear. What I'm finding today is that there are events, there are topics, all the way from you know, empowering cardholders to how you move money to how the card becomes more prominent in the phone. So there are a variety of topics which is really interesting. And industry seems to have shifted from just that PSG2 related kind of a topic to a more broader topic which is more relevant for banking industry. What is the unique selling proposition of OnDot? So I would break this question down into three parts. One of the most important thing that we believe in and are known for is consumer empowerment. People have been using their cards for making everyday purchases for last several decades. But the value of that card especially when it comes to associating a bar brand with the bank and consumer is being realized now. So one of the most important aspect of OnDot's offering is to ensuring that consumers are empowered, but the product is taken out to the cardholders by their banks. So we help traditional banks compete more effectively with challenger banks in this region by providing the technology stack that combines data, payment, and networking technology in real time. What are the issues and challenges are you facing while providing the solution? I think uh, traditional banks are focused on challenger banks to understand what they should be offering. But they are somewhat limited in terms of their understanding of what it takes because the solution capability may lie beyond banking and payment in traditional sense. So one of the challenges that we face is explaining to banks what it takes from the product and technology stack point of view to offer the products that they would need to compete more effectively because they have the relation with the consumers and they should be able to compete more effectively with challenger banks given their presence. So I think our biggest challenge is to rise above the noise in this space and get that attention from the banks so that they understand what it takes to offer new generation products in the marketplace. Going forward, what are the trends and advancements that we should expect to see in payments industry? Actually, the advancement you will see when they will start replacing their legacy system. The fact is that most of the payment and authorization processing systems are still built on, let's say, COBOL, or systems that were put in place 30, 40 years back. So there are very few people who can touch it. Now the advancement we'll see is either the banks will have to think about how do they migrate their legacy systems, which is a challenge, but more importantly, create this middleware that's required so that they can compete effectively in digital space while offloading their legacy systems from the day-to-day -day operations.